this fall football season. We've got a great new stadium, Mission Valley. Maybe you're going to check out an Aztecs game at Snapdragon Stadium. Joining me today to help you make your tailgate party right is Whitney Bond. She's a food blogger and Aztec. Yes. And, and, uh, and also a Sooner. So I guess tailgating is <laughs> kind of in your blood. Tailgating is definitely in my blood. Born and raised in Oklahoma. I went to games my whole life growing up. Moved to San Diego and became an Aztec. And I am so excited to check out Snapdragon Stadium and go to a game. We're going to the Hawaii game. It should be a great one. And so we've got everything you need for your tailgate or if you're home gating. It, you know, you're grilling okay. in the there backyard. There's a big game tonight. Chargers playing the Chiefs Thursday night football. So maybe you want to make one of these for dinner tonight. And, and you got pretty traditional, but also kind of mix it with Southern California flavor. We, we, we got tacos. Carne well, asada tacos. I mean, come on. That's yeah. a mainstay. You, you got to have that. You really have to have that. So we've marinated the steak in a chili lime marinade. It's so delicious. I like to serve them on little street uh, taco like size tortillas so you can share them. The idea with tailgate is you know you got lots of different foods you can share them so you can just like put your steak in there add whatever toppings you like but I do insist that everyone makes this. Okay, what's so that? This is the secret sauce. Okay. This is a cilantro lime crema. It is, oh it's like bursting with flavor literally. Um, okay, just I'm throw. Gonna I'm gonna have to try that. What else are you gonna put you on gotta, there? Then? You gotta oh, try that. A so cotija, do you I like I like a little cotija, a little onion. You, if you want to squeeze a little, little lime on there. This is a mainstay. That. I mean, it's the best. You got and how easy is it, is it to really make these tacos at a cookout, at, at a tailgate? Super easy to make. Just marinate it before you go to your tailgate, and then all you got to do is throw it on the grill for just a few minutes. So tender, so juicy. People are going to love it. I, I told you, it's the sauce. It's all, as you'll see, I really like my sauces. All right, so no fault, Whitney's. I can't try the I can't try the sliders today because <laughs> our our power cut off and it didn't cook it all the way. We lost the power. But, but you can do sliders. Those are really easy and very popular. These cheeseburger sliders are so good. And what I like to do at a tailgate to make it just a little more fun and unique is the trio of sauces. What do we got? So we've got a burger sauce, also known as the secret sauce. You know, you at, at some fast food chains. This is actually a sriracha ketchup. Oh, got a ketchup. So it's it. just sriracha and ketchup combined but everyone loves it because it has that little kick with the sweet ketchup and then that's a buffalo honey mustard sounds crazy but it's tangy it's sweet it's delicious you could put it on your burger make you it your have own one with each one you can exactly. mix them all up that, that's a great thing about sliders is that you know if one's not great you, you try another one try another it's one a little bit different sauce them all up differently all right and you gotta have okay. a dip you gotta have a dip you gotta have a dip okay, okay. And, but your dip is it's not no standard queso what do we got here this is this is no standard Oklahoma queso with Velveeta and Rotel now I <laughs> I still love that, but my husband thinks it's blasphemy. So this is a buffalo cheeseburger dip. Dig into this. Oh, yeah, it is dig in and so have you describe good. it for us. I love buffalo sauce, and I've been called the queen of buffalo sauce. So this has an entire cup of buffalo sauce in it. It's cream cheese, cheddar cheese, ground beef, a can of Rotel. You still have to throw it. See, you're going back for it. It's go so good. Food <laughs> coming out. Food coming out of my mouth. That's good. Every time I serve this at a party, I mean, it's the first thing to go. People go crazy for it. It's so delicious. You could put it, I like putting it in the crock pot. I cook it on the stove, put it in the crock pot. You can leave it all day. People snack on it. I mean, it'll last like 30 minutes, but. There you go. People <laughs> you go leave at it. all day if you want Are all the recipes at WhitneyBond.com? WhitneyBond.com. Now, you've been doing this. You came to San Diego in 2003. You've yes. been doing a blog since 2011? Yes. <laughs> uh, and cookbooks too? Yes, yeah. What, what's, what's one of the cookbooks can we tell people about? Uh, so, Buffalo Style was my original cookbook, all recipes with with uh, buffalo sauce on it, but you can find every recipe now online, so you don't have to buy a cookbook. They're all free on my website, WhitneyBond.com. There you go. And there's over 1,200 recipes, so it's, it's something your, for everyone. It's your one-stop shop for tailgate recipes and, and, and so much more, and, and it's from an Aztec, too, so you can yes. get into it and feel like you got school spirit. I'm going to send it in the studio now to Kirsten.